Hello, this is Par64 Guy. I've got a short little project I want to show you. Uh, this is one that I have actually already done, but I wanted to uh, make a little video about it just to show you what I did because I think this could help other people that might be in a similar situation. This is an IKEA Malm chest of drawers. Uh, they're relatively inexpensive. Um, make sure if you do get one that you anchor it to the wall. These are the ones that were known for uh, tipping over uh, if you open the top drawers and have too much weight. Uh, but that's a different subject. Uh, what I'm going to talk about here is a common thing that people buy is to help organize their drawers. Uh, they put these little um, dividers in. They are spring-loaded. And then you just put it in there. You don't have to use any tools and it lets you separate things like you know bras underwear socks whatever however one thing I found with the dresser or the chest of drawers rather is that the pressure from these springs will bow out the back wall causing the bottom of the drawer to fall out so I had to come up with something to remedy that and here's what I came up with so in order to solve the problem of the springs bowing out the back of the drawer, I fabricated this bracket using, and I'll link to the, uh, uh, to the part that I use. I basically just bought a little L bracket over at Walmart and I used a vise to bend it. It's holding the back wall to the bottom of the drawer and keeping it from bowing out when that spring pressure is applied inside the drawer. And it was, took me a little while, you know, it took me maybe, I don't know, 15 minutes to bend this. I just used a vise and a hammer. So this is the, fa the factory 90 degree bend. Uh, I used these two holes that were already in the bracket, drilled two holes in the bottom. I wanted to use nuts and bolts uh, because if I were to do like an angle screw into the wood here, it would just tear right out. This is particle board. It's cheap. It's not good under tension. So as I said, this is just a quick video. I just wanted to show you the bracket I made. I'm sure other people have a similar issue if they choose to use these spring-loaded dividers in a drawer that's not made of solid wood. Uh, actually, even solid wood could suffer from a little bit of bowing, but not as bad as a particle board-based uh, chest of drawers like something from Ikea. But anyway, so if you want to uh, know more about what I did or the process I used, um, comment below. And I will be happy to fashion up another bracket uh, on camera so that way you can actually see the process of it being made. Thank you very much. This is Part 64 Guy. See you later.